nothing is going to justify that. What's the point of being free if no one is left alive? Yo, are you still talking? Josh, are you still talking? Angry, bitter, remorse, no regret. Remorse. Maybe my judgment was clouded by anger. But everything that I did was for our people. We shouldn't forget who our enemies are. We can't fight amongst ourselves. He's right. All that matters now is what we do next. Marcus? Conversation, dialogue, stay hiding. Dialogue. Dialogue is the only way. I will go alone. No. Try to talk to them one last time. Don't no. Do this, Marcus. No, 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 that's not what I meant. You. That's not what I meant. Maybe. No. No. I have to try. No. No, 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 Confrontation. Can I restart the chapter? No, stop it. Hold on. No. Our buddy Marcus is not dying. Not today. Not at all. No, 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 no. Not today. Oh, my back. Oh, my backbone. Oh, my goodness. Sorry, guys. Let me, um, uh, you know. We're short on blue blood and bio components. Our wounded are shutting down and there's nothing we can do. President Warren is saying we're a threat to national security and we need to be exterminated. Humans are conducting raids in all the big cities and they're taking androids to camps to destroy them. It's a disaster. They're slaughtering our people. That's all our fault. None of this would have happened if we just stayed quiet. We couldn't just suffer in silence. They're killing us. Nothing is going to justify that. What's the point of being free if no one is left alive? Josh, shut up, monkey. Dang. Maybe my judgment was clouded by anger. But everything that I did was for our people. We shouldn't forget who our enemies are. We can't fight amongst ourselves. He's right. All that matters now is what we do next. 
Marcus. Fuck! Dialogue. No! I pressed it again. <laughs> no, I pressed it again. I pressed it again. game i knew that i didn't want to spend a really long time working on it because i was kind of in a situation where i didn't really have any money so i wanted to get a game out quick so that i could start earning something and so in order to motivate myself i was like oh i know what i'll do i'll set an incredibly unrealistic release date and tell people that i'm going to create this entire open world game in like four months i just figured for some reason that setting a really tight release date would make me more motivated Spoiler alert, it didn't. Basically, since I knew from the start that this was unrealistic, I kind of just wasn't really giving it my all for like the first probably four or five months. Because it's like, I knew that it wasn't possible to finish it that quick. So I was just like, eh, it's okay. I know I'll, I'll have to push the release date back anyway. So I'll just take a week off to, I don't know, make YouTube videos and crap. And so after a few months of development and that early 2022, release window came and went i went well yep i tried it out to make the most insane op hey you know that staring directly at the sun is bad for you right okay so you remember how the sun said that one day he'll become a red dwarf and swallow all of us yep that's hard to forget so what now how do we escape this freak of nature hey Remember we're talking about it got us last time? Well, sorry, I'm trying to save us from literally the end of the world! Just let it rest, man. Ugh, uh, you don't get it. I'll find someone smarter, okay? Ouch. Hey, Jupiter! I need your help! Sure, buddy. What can I do for you? I think we should find a better star and spin around that. Okay, hurry. I will. I'll hear ya. We're short on blue blood and biocomponents. Our wounded are shutting down, and there's nothing we can do. President Warren is saying we're a threat to national security, and we need to be exterminated. Humans are conducting raids in all the big cities, and they're taking androids to camps to destroy them. It's a disaster. They're slaughtering our people. That's all our fault. None of this would have happened if we just stayed quiet. Who the hell are you talking to? We couldn't just suffer in silence. They're killing us. Nothing is going to justify that. Why? I mean, our son sucks. What's he the point of being free if no one is left alive? No he constantly threatens to destroy us all. I get it, but he really is the best we've got. Other stars will also become red dwarfs one day, or go supernova. So I'll never regret standing yeah, up to that. We shouldn't forget who our enemies are. Right? Okay. We can't fight amongst right. ourselves. We He's right. All that matters now is what we do next. Marcus? We have to face them. There's no other choice. This is insanity. Get all the guns that you can find. We're going to free Detroit. I'm on it. You're making a mistake, Marcus. You won't buy our freedom with blood. Wait. 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 I chose the right one. <laughs> Sons, let's talk about what happened to not
We're short on blue blood and biocomponents. Our wounded are shutting down, and there's nothing we can do. President Warren is saying we're a threat to national security, and we need to be exterminated. Humans are conducting raids in all the big cities, and they're taking androids to camps to destroy them. It's a disaster. They're slaughtering our people. That's all our fault. None of this would have happened if we just stayed quiet. All we did was show them who we really are. I don't want war, but I'd rather die free than live as a slave. What's the point of being free if no one is left alive? Yo, dude, shut your mouth, monkey man. Gosh, wait, let me see. No regrets. Humans enslaved us. I'll never regret standing up to that. We shouldn't forget who our enemies are. We can't fight amongst ourselves. He's right. All that matters now is what we do next. Okay. Marcus? Stay quiet. No, we cannot stay quiet. Stay hiding new. Mm. Free, because if we stay high. Dialogue is the only way. I will go alone. Try to talk to them one last time. Don't do this, Marcus. They'll kill you. Maybe. But North, I have to try. If I don't come back, lay low as long as you can. Just come back. They need to realize how much they're hurting us. Find the right words, and they'll listen. Humans can't be reasoned with. They're violent, hateful, they're stupid. What do they expect us to do? Shut up and obey? They can't stop what we've started, giving me hope. Today, a deviant arrived in Jericho and he told me that he stole a truck transporting radioactive cobalt. He said that he abandoned the truck somewhere in Detroit and rigged it to explode. I convinced him not to do it, to give me the detonator. A dirty bomb. We can't lose this war, Marcus. If humans overcome us, our people will disappear forever. This may be our only chance to survive if things go wrong. Fuck, I don't know. We shouldn't become like them, North. We can gain our freedom by other means. I hope you're right. Whatever happens tomorrow, I just want you to know that I... I'm glad I met you. Yeah. I'll go join the others. Look after yourself. I don't want to lose you. Who would it? Ah. Succeeded in locating Jericho and finding their leader. Now deal with Marcus. We need it alive. Stop, Marcus. 
take you alive. But I won't hesitate to shoot if you give me no choice. Yes, you can shoot me. But it won't change anything. Someone else will just take my place. You see, our people are waking up. And nothing can stop us now. You're coming with me! I know you. You're Connor, aren't you? That famous deviant hunter. Well, congratulations. You seem to have found what you were looking for. Convince a pure Our cause is righteous and we are more than what they say. All we want is to live in freedom. See nothing. Listen to him. Have you never wondered who you really are? Whether you're just a machine executing a program or a living being, capable of reason. I think the time has come for you to ask yourself that question. Do you never have any doubts? You've never done something irrational? As if there's something inside you? Something more than your program. It's time to decide. Become a deviant or remain a machine. Become a deviant. I don't think I'd be doing that today. I don't think I want to stop Marcus. I kind of like this dude. <laughs> Let's get it. Let's get it. Let's get into it, yeah. Get into it, yeah. I don't care about men. They're them. going to attack Jericho. What? We have to get out of here. in the hold they're gonna be slaughtered there are exits on the second and third floor find them and jump in the river where's Simon and Josh I don't know we got separated they're coming from the upper deck now too we'll be caught in the crossfire we have to run Marcus there's nothing we can do we have to blow up Jericho if the ship goes down they'll evacuate and our people can escape you'll never make it the explosives are all the way down in the hold. There are soldiers everywhere. She's right. They know who you are. They'll do anything to get you. Go and help the others. I'll join you later. Marcus! I won't be long. No, not 
This is the end of Jericho. Save our people, Marcus. in danger. Go now before they come back. What about you? What are you going to do? I'll manage. Alice is all that matters. I don't want to leave you, Luther. Don't worry. I'll catch up with you at the border, okay? Go now. Take care of each other. Sorry, Alice, but... There was nothing we could do. You have to go. Join you later. Way out. We're safe, Alice. Stop. Get down. Don't kill me. 
please don't kill me. Oh, you're dead. Ha <laughs> El Bozo. Not Bay. It's too late, Marcus. There's nothing we can do for her. We've got to run. Connor, show me some Connor. Show me some Connor. Show me some Connor. All right, shut up. Bone. See Carl. Carl. Huh. 
Days. Who are you? How did you get in? I need to see Carl. Carl isn't seeing anyone. You need to leave. Please. I need to see him. He's very weak. I'm not sure he'll be able to talk to you. What's wrong, Marcus? I'm completely lost, Carl. The whole world's falling apart around me. I try to do the right thing. I look for answers. I... Instead, I just find more doubts and more uncertainty. The world is ruled by fear, Marcus. Fear of others. Fear of the future. It's like me, too old. It's time for a dam. Humans hate us. They want to destroy us because we refuse to be their slaves anymore. I'm not going to stand around and wait for them to slaughter my people. You used to be so calm and thoughtful. Now all I see is anger. You're right. You're right, I am angry. But don't worry, I won't let my emotions take over. I just want freedom for my people and I Guess I need to decide what price I'm willing to pay for it. You're my son, Marcus. Our blood isn't the same color. But I know part of me is in you. When the world falls into darkness, some men have the courage to lead it out. You're one of those men. Face the abyss. But don't let it consume you.
this. Marqueus. Where's Kara? And then I'll go there. Alright, Dr. Josh first. <laughs> Snowbot. If it weren't for you, I'd be dead. Thanks to you, I might see her people free one day. You and I haven't always agreed, but I know that we're fighting for the same thing. Dude, like... Whatever you decide, I'm with you, Marcus. Joshy boy. Was that north? It's north. What's your system status? I'm okay. The bullet didn't hit any bike components. You could have been killed trying to save me, Marcus. You have to think of our people first. Nothing else matters. How many of us survived the attack? A few hundred. Maybe more if you count those hiding all over the city. If you hadn't <coughs> triggered the bomb, we'd all be dead. There aren't even five different camps in the Detroit area. They're building more all across the country. They're preparing for a genocide. In a few hours, it'll all be over. Like the Jews. We'll have changed the world, and the world will have destroyed us. You have to make a choice, Marcus. But whatever you choose, we will follow you. I love you, Marcus. You start making love right there. I thought you'd be safe staying with us. I was wrong. You need to leave the city while you still can. Getting Alice away from here is all that matters now. We have to catch the last bus. We might still have a chance to cross the border. Marcus. Save our people. Dude, this music, bro, I can't. Don't let us start crying, bro. Oh, look at us. Man. What is color remind me of? It's my fault the humans managed to locate Jericho. I was stupid. I should have guessed they were using me. I'm sorry, Marcus. <coughs> I can understand if you decide not to trust me. No, Connor, we're, you're, you're coming with us. You're one of us now. Your place is with your people. There are thousands of androids at the Cyberlife assembly plant. 
If we could wake them up, they might join us and shift the balance of power. You want to infiltrate the Cyberlife Tower? Connor, that's suicide. They trust me. They'll let me in. If anyone has a chance of infiltrating Cyberlife, it's me. If you go there, they will kill you. There's a high probability. But statistically speaking, there's always a chance for unlikely events to take place. Foreshadowy. Be careful. Don't get up. What? Say something stupid. It's like smacking your face. Are people accounting on you, Marcus? No, they're counting on. Uh, You're the only one who could lead us. G -B -B -S. What? Wherever you need to go, we'll follow you. Francisco, love baby. Fulfill your choice. Okay. Church is reckoning. Humans have decided to exterminate us. Our people are packed in camps right now, being destroyed. Time has come to make a choice. Dick. One that very well may determine the future of our people. March peacefully toward the camps and pressure the authorities. Launch an assault on the camps and liberate the Antarctic Revolution. Demonstration. I know. I know you're all angry. And I know you want to fight back, but I assure you violence is not the answer here. We are going to tell them peacefully that we want justice. Well, fuck and if you. there's any humanity in them, they will listen. And if not, others will take our place and continue this fight. Are you ready to follow me? At 6 a.m. this morning, a national curfew was declared. Civilian movement will be strictly controlled. The right to assembly is suspended. All <coughs> electronic communications are restricted, and I have granted enhanced powers to our security agencies. In addition to these measures, all androids must be handed over to the authorities immediately. 
Temporary camps are being set up in all our major cities to contain and destroy them. I am now asking all civilians to cooperate with the authorities and rest assured that everything in our power is being done to guarantee the security of our nation. Please! Madam President! Please! Has the leader of the Deviants been apprehended? The Deviant that is known as Marcus has not been located yet, but we will soon track it down and neutralize it. Please! Please! Is it true that the androids could hack our IT systems, like nuclear power plants and military bases? All androids working on sensitive sites have been neutralized, and all IT systems have been suspended to avoid any risks of hacking. The situation is under control. Please! Please! Madam President! Madam President, public opinion seems to have become increasingly favorable to the Deviants, particularly since they've adopted a peaceful approach. How do you feel about this? Public opinion is one thing, the security of the state is another. These deviants are dangerous, and my highest priority is to protect no, the American not. people. Madam President! Please? Over here, please? Madam President! Please! Madam President! What's gonna happen to Cyberlife? <coughs> Will androids be banned definitively? We're working very closely with CyberLife to neutralize all deviants. I won't make any comments about anything else until we've dealt with the android question. Thank you. That will be all. Well, 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 like, shut up, monkey. You're a monkey. I hate monkeys. Monkey, monkey, monkey. Dirty ad monkey. Connor, the Andrew sent by Cyberlife. Connor model 313 248 317. I'm expected. Identification successful. Okay. Go ahead. Gotta get a thumbnail. Pause.